we lose friends. I'm one of the older people here. I've lost a lot of friends over the years. But two friends I want to comment on that really touched my life and gave it much meaning. Several years ago, Baroness Fiona Maidenhead from Eldermere died, and she was very special to me. On one of my first events, I went with the Dragon Herald, who was not good about introducing me to people. <laughs> and I, we were in Michigan, and I'm from Southern Illinois. I'm not going to person, but I was kind of out of my element. And Fiona took me under her wing and talked to me and introduced me to people. And we loved each other. And when she, this sounds my sound creepy, when she died, she was cremated. And her, her daughters decided that there were several special people that could not make the funeral. So they put some of her ashes in the container. And <laughs> she liked roses. And she made rose jam. I sprinkled some of her, she get, I was one of the recipients, recipients of ashes. I sprinkled some of my roses at home. And then I brought her to Pinsick. And another friend of mine, Baroness Billson, Telemore's wife, also has ashes, and we brought them to Pinsy. And we weren't morbid about it, it was just Fiona loved Pinsy and her friends there, so she was part of Pinsy. And the other one I want to remember very quickly, I recently went to a memorial service for Duchess Serena, one of the first queens of the Rebrand. And then she was Moonwolf's first queen. <laughs> she always says, she was not his first queen. He was her second king. <laughs> but I didn't know her in the early in my early years of, of SCA. I don't knew about her. And then I met her several years ago when she was her, her mother was sick. Her mother was in her late nineties, by the way. And she herself had cancer. But she and I bonded. And she meant a lot to me because in the SCA. We have friends. All of you are special to me because we have the same interests. I'll just say, Fiona and Zarina, like the name others, <clears throat> touched my life and will have ever changed my life, hopefully for the better.